Good evening and thank you for joining us. Thunder Bay Police have had to move some officers into the Coast Guard building at Kiefer Terminal due to a lack of space at the Balmoral headquarters. The traffic unit has already been relocated and the emergency task unit is doing their training there. Acting Chief Dan Taddeo says it's another unfortunate example of why they need a new, larger police station. Jonathan Wilson reports. Uh, space is a serious situation here at the police headquarters building. Acting Police Chief Dan Taddeo has been searching for options on how to deal with their lack of space. And they're now leasing a portion of the Coast Guard building at Kiefer Terminal, which is owned by Fisheries and Oceans Canada. The lease price is $125,000 per year. When that came to be, we realized that there was a good flexible training space there. That was one of our key uh, things we were looking at uh, due to the lack of training space here. We had to do a lot of renovations to the place to make it up to uh, our standard and compliant. Obviously a lot of security infrastructure and uh, IT infrastructure and so on and so forth. So uh, that's been uh, more or less completed. The emergency task unit is using the building for training purposes and the traffic unit officers were relocated there after the cybercrime unit needed their space at the Balmoral Station. Um, our traffic is based out of there. Uh, we have space now that they can do proper reconstruction uh, diagrams and uh, the processes they're uh, involved in, especially wintertime when um, motor vehicle collisions uh, increase. Tadio points out they already had other units working in satellite offices, such as the court officers all being located in the city courthouse and their forensic staff working at the OPP Forensics Building on Wall Street. But Tadio admits having units around the city does impact the police force's overall efficiency. You can't be as spread out uh, as we are right now and, and still uh, say that our communication is optimal or our efficiencies are more optimal. There's other costs that come associated with it. Necessity of having vehicles just for transportation back and forth, like I mentioned, is, is just one example. The planning for a new $56 million police headquarters was slowed down over the past year while the focus shifted to internal issues. Tadio is hoping for more than a dozen extra officers next year and says they may have to set up portables outside the Balmoral Station to fit everyone in. And the next step is going into 2023 uh, with the added pressures we have with the staff that are required to properly police the city. We still have to look at more space and like I said, that could unfortunately include portables until we do get the new police facility. Jonathan Wilson, TBT News.